my name is Steve West. I work for ABB Robotics. I've been with ABB about 14 years, and I'm here today to talk to you about our vision-guided robotics solution called TrueView. And the demo that you see here running right now is an example of how a robot with a single camera can find an object that's randomly presented in 3D. So it's going from a random location to a very precise location. And it's doing that with a single camera, which is unique. In most 3D applications, you'll see two cameras or a camera and a laser used together to locate an object in 3D. Some of the advantages of having a single camera are, first of all, the calibration of the system is quite simple and effective. Um, typically, in an application like this, you can calibrate in less than 15 minutes, whereas if you have a camera and a laser or two cameras, the calibration can be difficult, time-consuming. The other thing that you have when you carry the, the camera and the lights together is you have a lot of control over your lighting technique. So in this case, we can use a certain intensity of light to find the object, and then a second intensity of light to find the location to which the object's going. If you look at the business case for vision-guided robotics, I think you'll see two things that drive manufacturers to consider vision with robots. The first is that when the robot has the ability to see the object, it's not necessary to use very expensive conveyors, uh, dunnage, and uh, part locators. Basically, the robot can, can take and, uh, and find the object instead of having to crowd the object or have precision locators or precision dunnage. The second advantage of using a robot um, with vision is that if you do have a conveyor system or you do have uh, uh, containers and they become deformed over time, the robot's capable of seeing that and, and dealing with the variations that the parts may uh, present to the robot. In addition to using a single camera to locate an object in 3D, there's a variety of other techniques that are available. Um, if you have an object that is not rich with features, it's possible to use what's called structured light, which is taking a laser and actually applying that laser across the part so that the camera has more uh, features to actually find and locate. Um, there are some other ways in addition to that. Uh, we use sta uh, static cameras or stationary cameras. You can have multiple cameras surrounding a part to locate it in 3D. Okay, so just to wrap up, I uh, appreciate your time. And again, this is TrueView Single Camera 3D using a, a single camera to locate an object in 3D space. Thank you.